Hello friends, I am Dr. Prashant Sharma and you are watching Medicos Hub. In this video, I am going to discuss the configuration of DL doses by Kiliani Fischer Synthesis. We know that Kiliani Fischer Synthesis elongates the carbon chain by one carbon atom. So, to get the next configuration, we know that every time two diastereomers will be formed and to start with, I am taking the D glyceraldehyde. It is a triose and every time we will add the carbon atom with H and OH group in this position in between the first and second carbon. So the CHO will remain as it is. These arrangement of H and OH hydroxyl group will also remain as it is and the new carbon will be added like this one with hydroxyl on this side another with hydroxyl on this side now this one is D erythrose and this one is D threos. Again, Kiliani Fischer synthesis will be done in D erythrose. Then, again, two compounds will be obtained in which will keep the uh, will add the new carbon atom here. So, remaining arrangement will be same in both molecules like CH2H H OH H OH this will remain same and the CHO is also same and the difference will be of this carbon atom in which OH is placed on this side and here the OH is placed on this side. Thus, we will obtain D ribose and D arabinose. In the same way, if the procedure is repeated for D threos, then this region will remain same and this will also remain same and the new carbon is added in between. So OH, H, H, OH. This is same and CHO is again taken at same position and the difference will be created by this entering carbon atom with H and OH. As a result, we'll obtain D xylose and D lixose. If the procedure is again repeated for these pentoses, then aldohexoses will be obtained. Now, we will keep the we will keep these two portions intact and will add the new carbon atom in between the CHO and the remaining structure. Now what will happen, we will uh, we'll keep the remaining structure same and also the CHO that is aldehyde on the same position. Now the new carbon which will create the difference 
will be placed like this. Now this molecule which is obtained is D allows and this molecule which is obtained is D altrose. In the same way, if Kiliani Fischer synthesis proceeds in D arabinose, then what will happen? This will remain intact and this will remain intact and the new carbon is added in this position. So, OH, H, H, CHO kept intact and the new carbon which will create the difference will be at this position. Now what we are getting? This is D glucose. The most important hexose and this is D mannose. If the procedure is repeated for D xylose, then again this will remain intact and the new carbon will be added in between these two first and second carbon. So this is CHO, CHO, H, OH, H. and the carbon that is being added or creating the difference will be added like this producing two diastereomers and this one is d glulose and this one is d idose And the last one, FD Lexose, is undergoing the Kiliani Fischer synthesis, then again this region will be kept intact and the carbon is added between this is where these two carbons, new carbon will be added. And first we'll write this. and the new carbon will be added in this region. Now, what we are obtaining by this first step that is D galactose and D tallose. So this is the configuration of DL doses by Kiliani Fisher Synthesis. Hit the like button, share and subscribe our channel to get the latest updates and notifications.